All right, today is deadlift day, Wendler, week two, cycle whatever. It's all about the threes up to 90% of your best, or your training max deadlift. And I started with some power cleans. Nothing special was happening there today. Little fatigued. Spent the weekend at Disney walking around with my nine-year-old, my seven-year-old, my wife, and my 82-year-old mom who can still hang at Disney with the family. And I ate a lot of food, drank a lot of beer, still 165 pounds. But if you've ever been to Epcot and you've been to the German restaurant, you know the type of food I was eating. Lots and lots of starch. So I kind of low carbed it today. And uh, been eating a lot of hard boiled Easter eggs, which I was instructed to do by my wife because we never waste any food and I eat it all. So hard boiled Easter eggs, some fruit, and I need to get some vegetables, but I had a peanut butter sandwich, so I just, I got a, a little carbs back in my system here. But I only, only 165. Now this is only 347.75 pounds because Dumbo here forgot to put the uh, other 2.75 pound plate on the bar. It's missing from, uh, the left side looking at that bar it's missing a 2.75 but I didn't seem to notice I, I had about four reps uh, you know I have to do three reps so I, I felt a little guilty here so I went back to 350 my original plan was to do 350 for four or five and then get another set kind of getting into a little bit of nosebleed territory uh, I haven't spent much time uh, above 350 except a month and a half ago where I kind of just jumped right to 405 because I knew I could pull it but uh, from here on in, it gets interesting with 5 through 1 because I'll start moving into the 350s. And that's a good place for me to be to kind of just develop some strength, work on keeping tight. And you got to love these, the illuminated front squats. I'm missing my head at the top. But I have 195 on there, doing some pause squats, spending some time ATG style down in the bottom there. And that feels pretty good when you're down there. And I have to say, this is this is kind of helping me with the squats. I've been kind of noticing I'm putting like 10 or 15 pounds more on lately, you know, when I'm just kind of doing my off-day squat workouts. And this is a little off-day squat workout here. And I'm doing the pauses occasionally, mixing it up. Tomorrow I have overhead press. I'll be back. I had to miss that one for the weekend. Catch you later.